At the time of my visit, the school was on break and teachers had left for their respective bases. According to residents, the unplastered mud classroom walls are usually washed away by rain. The weak, insecure and fallen structure with leaking roofs make it unsafe for human habitation. Children are compelled to sit on logs and endure all the harsh conditions. <laughs> There was a day the building nearly collapsed for my grandchildren. So please come to our aid and construct a new school for us. The structure can collapse on the children. They run back home anytime they go to school. And we can't blame the teachers. It is not their fault. Anytime it rains, they have to run back home. Community leaders say neglect of the school without renovation put children in danger. Then I chance on this structure close to the Bonoso MA Primary School. It started four months ago to replace the old mud block. Thomas Apia Kobi is municipal chief executive of Asante Mampong. When the 2016 engineering uh, campaign, I came here as a constituency chairman to observe that the, the, the classrooms, the supposed classroom in which the children of Bunso are attending um, or having their learning um, activities was not something that was the best. Okay. So as a chairman that time, I promised the people here that uh, should the party come to power and should Ronaldo become the president, uh, Ronaldo will make all efforts to ensure that the right and the better place is provided for the children of Bunso for the primary school um, activities. So, by the grace of God, the party won, and, and the honors of Danado Danko Akufado, I became the MC for the municipality. So my party coordinator here, the SMC, the assemblyman, and the headmaster for this school came to my office to remind me of the promise that I made on behalf of the party. So I also sat down with my uh, lieutenants and my team at the assembly to look at the quickest means through which we will provide the uh, better accommodation for our uh, children at Bunso for the primary school activities. So we, we initially drew a, a program or a plan so that uh, we could provide a pavilion type of classroom for the children and in the future we'll be able to um, continue and then add some values or some um, other cost to it so that it becomes a full-fledged classroom uh, block. Our elders say if you have a serene environment, you would have a peace of mind. If our children have a convenient place to study and learn, then we are also happy. We are very happy. This new structure comes handy for the children but they have to wait for a while to enjoy its comfort. Mahmoud Mohammed Nuruddin reporting.